So one of our key initiatives under our omics pillar is called the Emirati Genome Program, which we are running at scale in Abu Dhabi. It's a, it's a very uh, aggressive, uh, ambitious program where we are sequencing the entire population for the first time, and it's one of the largest initiatives across the globe. So the, the fruits of this program is something that we are excited about, and I do believe it's going to change the paradigm of how healthcare system is going to be looked at. I would name two main technologies. One is artificial intelligence, which is our bread and butter, and cloud computing. I'll just give you some examples where we are applying both of these technologies into one space. So AI technologies, we are currently doing gene annotation across the Emirati reference genome. Keep in mind, the Emiratis have never been sequenced before, so we're using multiple techniques of AI to annotate this data set so that it can be useful for researchers. And cloud computing, each Emirati genome is roughly around 500 gigabase of data. We have to come up with the right storage mechanism so this can be compressed and accessible to the world in the right way. So I would say these two technologies are essential for driving digital health. There's a lot of key initiatives that are potentially changing uh, the health trends. One is, I think, the panel discussion that we were he here today for is cloud adoption. I think that's going to transform the way people look at healthcare because pre previously it was looking at healthcare data sets in silos and now you have it aggregated in one place. Second, I think federated learning is something essential uh, that irrespective of data being in different countries and different borders, you could apply federated learning across these data sets. So I do believe these two initiatives is potentially going to change the trajectory of healthcare systems.